Oh, I bet there was a lot of yeehaw on the set of this one. <laughs> Star Wars. This episode was directed by Robert Rodriguez, and I can kind of just imagine him and Filoni on set, both wearing their cowboy hats, being howdy, 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 comparing and talking about different types of cowboy hats, because those guys both love to wear cowboy hats. Anyways, this episode was about the Mando and Grogu going to the Seeing Stone, this specific site of Jedi legacy, and there they encounter two very big surprises. One being the thing that they kind of teased at the beginning of the uh, the season. That was a cool surprise, and that was actually a pretty cool moment seeing those guys in action, and that's kind of the extent of the episode, because to be honest, absolutely nothing happens in this episode except for one thing, and that they have to go and save Grogu. Again. Now, I do say that the action in this episode, despite being as far into the limit of PG as they could go, it was pretty well done, and we know that Robert Rodriguez could do that. We know that the guy has a hand for action, and he can do this kind of stuff. However, this is probably the lightest episode on story of all of them, and the most emotional thing that happens is the ship gets blown up, because I actually felt more lost for that than for when Grogu got abducted again. Because we didn't even get to see the robot things do anything. They just flew down, picked them up, and flew back up again. And that was it. That was the extent of these things that they teased in the episode before. Then we see him go to where Kalagajina is, and he's like, hey, I need help. I also need Bill Burr for some reason. And I'm really hoping that if Bill, in fact, is coming back in the next episode, that they take him off the morphine drip that they had him in the previous season. Because I've never seen Bill Burr so dead. I, I want to see the man be funny. So I'm hoping that that happens, but we'll see. This episode is a very, very, very much middle of the road. If anything, this is probably the least entertaining episode to me in terms of story. Action, sure, but it's kind of the weakest episode of this season so far. And that's a lot to say, considering how stellar majority of this season has been. It's clearly a placeholder. And it also kind of brings up the conversation of what they're going to do with season three. How can they keep relating the story to him protecting Grogu and him kind of taking on this thing? Because it's going to get old fast. That's a bit to say, obviously. But the stick is starting to wear a little bit thin, so I'm hoping that maybe... In the last three episodes we get a little bit more but so far there's a continuing narrative that looks like it's being established so the next three episodes are all probably going to be one thing so that's a pretty good thing anyways i'm going to give this episode a four out of seven it was enjoyable it was fun but very very little happened in it and i was a little bit disappointed on that it was cool to see robert rodriguez do something again and also the big reveal which i won't say that's the only thing i won't spoil about this episode but that was really cool to see this character again, played by the actor who plays him. Just everything about it was really, really fun, and the fact that they are continuing to come back in the next few episodes, at least, is going to be real, real damn fun. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this review. If you did, leave a like, and if you're interested in more, subscribe. Otherwise, see you guys next time. Thanks for watching the video. My name is Nitz, and you might remember me from the animated cult classic TV show, Undergrads. It's been a while, but I'm happy to say the click is finally getting back together in an all-new movie, thanks to a successful Kickstarter campaign. But we are still asking for your support. To see any and all updates about the upcoming Undergrads movie, be sure to check out and like the Bring Back Undergrads Facebook page. And with any luck, we'll see you guys soon.